I don't want to talk about it. Welcome to vlogging. Daily I'm doing it. And I don't have an intro song. So this is it. Welcome and in okay. enjoy it. Bye. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about the fact that I'm pretty sure I have a really bad ulcer right now and it is ruining my life. Not to be dramatic. I keep having things go wrong with my body. Like, girl, get it together. I feed you right. We exercise, we stretch. We go outside and get the sun. We come inside and get AC. What is your issue? Like, girl, I've had ulcers before. I had one really bad one in 2020 that I went to the ER for and they were like, just take some Pepto, you idiot. So I don't wanna go back to the doctor if it's just an ulcer, but it's been in one spot and it's very painful after I eat and it's fine if I do little meals and stay to the good stuff, but if I have a massive meal or eat something I'm not supposed to, it flares up, ulcer. I'm drinking the Peptos, doing the things, and it won't go away, it kept me up last night, it hurt all Saturday, it's Monday now. Yesterday it went back and forth and it makes me feel bloaty and my stomach looks a little bloaty, but farting doesn't make it feel better, guys. It does nothing. I'm just struggling. And the worst part is, they say you can't have caffeine. They said, do not drink coffee when you've got an ulcer. So guess what I'm starting my morning off with? Tea. Online, I looked up, you know, what to eat and what to not eat, blah, blah, blah. One thing said green tea is really good for you, even though it has that caffeine in that. I don't understand the science. That's fine, coffee's caffeine is bad, but green tea's caffeine is good. Getting a little selective here. Playing favorites, I see. Rude. And then another thing said drink honey. So I'm gonna put honey in my tea. I just took a shot of Pepto. And I have to eat small meals that aren't super salty, that aren't spicy, that aren't chocolate, that's not alcohol, that's not caffeine. What else am I not allowed to have? I can't have creams or milk, I don't eat that. Or fatty meats, I don't eat that. Or fried food, or citrus, or tomato. I love tomato. But I can add, have herbs and spices, but I can't have heavily spiced food. I can have green tea, but not coffee. I can have grains, I can have healthy fats, but not fatty meats. I can have fermented dairy, but not milk and cream. I can have soy wheat foods, eggs. I can have seafood, that's good. I have lean meat, I don't want that. I can have legumes, vegetables and fruit, but not citrus fruit. Y'all are getting particular here. I don't know how I'm supposed to eat. That is a confusing list. <sighs> I do know mushrooms and avocado are good for me. So, and grains. So wheat grains, so I'm gonna eat avocado wheat toast and maybe some mushroom for dinner. Relax. Okay, so this is my journey with my self-diagnosed ulcer. I'm currently in pain. It's not affecting my mood. You're fine. <sighs> I think I lost my consciousness in a sixth dimension. As I am right now. I don't know the words of the songs. Hi. I'm off the, to the store because today's video that we're filming, one day, I swear to God, one day I'm gonna learn words and your minds will be blown. You won't know what to do with it when I learn how to speak. Uh, we'll all be shocked when that happens. Okay, who's driving my car? There's no way that this is right. I'm too high. Anyway, um, I'm off to the store because we are gonna film. Oh, oh, oh my God, are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, I'm so sorry. We're filming viral TikTok food. Getting a little aggressive there. Yeah, I can leave it. We're filming viral TikTok foods. I can't eat any of them because of my ulcer. So I'm going to have to taste them and then spit them out. And then Emily can eat them. So I'm off to the store. I'm dying without coffee. I can't have coffee with an ulcer. And I'm dying, guys. I'm dying. Thought I got everything. Yeah, now I'm realizing I'm getting Pepto. I'm out of Pepto, so. Oh, here it is. Better get the big bottle because your girl's not getting any better. If this keeps up, I'm gonna have to go to the doctor. I don't wanna go to the doctor. I don't wanna. This one, cool coats. Insta cool. I don't need anything cool in me. I don't need, I don't need it to cool me. Never mind. You're okay. I don't need it. It's fine. All right, Emily and I were filming. You can make noise. 
Emily and I were filming a video and I was texted my friend Kelly, um, who is in the medical field. And I told her about my ulcer and she's like, yeah, just go to the doctor, get antibiotics. She never tells me to go to the doctor. I was like, Pfft. so I called my, my primary care physician because I have one of those now because I was an adult and got one. And uh, they said, yeah, we can do a telehealth conference. And I was like, oh, okay. So I'm waiting for them to answer my call. And they said, I think she said 320, but I have to be here at, I had to sign in at 250. You're, I made Emily something to eat for our video and it's gonna get soggy. Or can I say, let's just eat it. Let's just turn it on until, okay. Yeah. All right. Vlog, oh, I just got done with my conference with my doctor. She says, she doesn't think it's an ulcer, it's like, gastric acid something because of where I pointed on my belly. I don't know, I have a prescription, I gotta go pick up a CVS. <laughs> and if it doesn't, if my medicine doesn't work, I have to go see the GI. Getting old's fun, ladies. <laughs> you have to vlog. I you have to have. Oh, everyone looks so cute. Oh my God, thank you. <laughs> Hi, way change of scene. We are at the beach because we're gonna play some beach volleyball. Um, I'm already tired though. I did a leg workout earlier. I got my medicine though, my tummy feels better. Always. Come on, time to start. Wait, we're gonna do like one of those slow montages. Beach girls. They're gone. Well, and when I was at home, I was just. volleyball I had to sit out the last game because my tummy hurts Alana let me know I was just describing what I had and she said yeah GERD <laughs> and I said no she said yeah that's GERD it's just they don't call it GERD until you're like 80 but you have GERD <laughs> and my shoulder was hurting from my tendonitis am I 90 years old Man, I, don't know what to do with you. I don't know what we're gonna do with me either I'm a good Enough person. <laughs> I should not be having these issues. I agree. Wait, okay, tell them tell them who was like voted MVP of volleyball for the night. Andre. Oh no, I think you missed where everyone said Emily, Emily. They said move, Andre needs the spotlight. Oh right. <laughs> right Emily, you're in the way. <laughs> Emily, you're always in the way. <laughs> no, you were really good though. And for a delicious dinner because of my GERD, I'm having split pea soup. I have to do small meals, a bunch of small meals, but I can't eat too close to bed. So it's 8.30, I'm gonna eat this and be done for the night. I also have to sleep with pil multiple pillows under me. So I'm sitting, sleeping at somewhat of an upright position. Bye. This isn't fun. All right, y'all, that's it for this vlog. Look at me, two vlogs in a row. What are we back on track? What is this? I've noticed this happening with me. I just have so many wispy baby hairs. What's going on? Am I balding? Is that part of my 90 year old body now? That I'm just everything? I tried to blind myself the other week apparently with a leaf. That was fun. What is going on? Why? Why? All right, but you know, I'm getting my GERD under control. Last night they were like, do we call you Gertie now? I said, no, you're not calling me Gertie. So I put a poo on that. But anyway, I love you guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I will be back tomorrow with hopefully another vlog. I gotta go shower. I gotta go eat. But only a small meal. And only a small meals. I'm just tired. <laughs>